but it was just like, and then and and then I told Bill Gates, no, you should create Microsoft. I mean, that's what I told Bill Gates. Oh, howdy, tube -ubers. Um, yeah. Today's video is about um, well, movies. Well, no shit, duh. Uh, what's that one film you have sitting on your shelf, whether it's opened? or it's still in its crisp, clean wrapping that you've had forever, whether you bought it online or you bought it in a store, and it just continues to sit there, and you have yet to see it, you have yet to watch it, or perhaps maybe you've attempted to watch it a couple times, but something occurs to make you shut it off and put it away, and you say, well, I'll go back to it another day. For me... It's this movie here, Scrap Heaven. It's a Japanese film um, starring Joe Adagiri, Ryo Kase, and Chiaki Kiriyama of the, uh, of course, uh, Battle Royal and uh, Kill Bill fame. So yeah, this basically is a movie about revenge. Um, there's a pharmacist, a policeman, a toilet cleaner. They find their lives turned upside down when their bus is hijacked by a crazed businessman. When the ride turns violent, the three strangers are forever linked by the incident. Months later, Tetsu talks Shingo into collaborating on a most unique business venture, Revenge for Hire. Anyone with a problem can come to them, and they'll take the appropriate vengeful measures. Meanwhile, Saki, disillusioned and increasingly antisocial, also, also wishes to take out her own revenge on society. So, I mean, really cool. This is a Tokyo Shock release, back when Best Buy used to carry Tokyo Shock. And I think this came out on DVD in 2007. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. That's six years ago. And I believe I bought this the day it came out. I popped it in twice, and every time I have, something has happened to um, stop me from finishing it or whatnot. I think I've gotten maybe 20 minutes in. And you know, the weird thing is, I've really liked what I've seen of it a couple times. So this is the one movie that I have that just continues to sit there, and I tell myself, I'm going to watch the damn thing. I Actually, I went to Amazon to uh, look up reviews and stuff on it, and uh, really weird that one, one of the few movies on Amazon that has absolutely no reviews whatsoever. So, yeah. But this is the film. It just continues to sit on that shelf right back there in the Asian section. And I'm going to get around to watching the damn thing. I swear to you, I will. Let's see how much longer it sits there, folks. I don't know. It's a mystery. Thanks for watching. Cheerio.